everyone so gonna be talking about episode 36 today uh this was a very interesting episode i found it to be uh quite crazy really um you know ibuki having defeated the um concert master takudo uh is now being possessed by uh the destiny conductor here which is going to be really crazy and uh this episode already just kicked off right away with a lot of action uh being that suiko reka and uh corin are starting vanguards for uh, this so-called invasion of Psyqualia here. So, unlike the original series where we actually had the uh, Link Joker arc and everyone was reversed, in this case, everyone's actually getting Psyqualia. I think that's actually quite crazy considering um, or comparing it to the likes of uh, Reversed. So, seeing that, I don't know how much stronger these characters actually are. Uh, but basically, like, Asuka's been possessed now and uh, even Kawanami, the dog guy, and it's just, you know, even Kyo is being uh, possessed in this, and it's good to see that he's actually taking more of a uh, bigger uh, screen time in this particular one, or a bigger role in this particular arc, hopefully he does, but uh, the fact that he got screen time right now of him being possessed, and we know that he's a strong player, it's definitely going to be very interesting to see what happens uh, throughout this entire arc. A Psyqualia invasion is something that I just really did not expect at all. Uh, I thought everyone was going to be reversed, but, you know, perhaps we'll find out what happens. Because I want to know what's the difference between someone who's reversed or someone who actually has Psyqualia. But, you know, with Psyqualia, I just wonder what kind of role Ren will actually play in this particular arc um so it's going to be very interesting here uh same case with tetsu he's now lost his entire uh card fighting side i mean you can see that a lot of these uh possessed uh psychoalia zombies didn't even consider uh, tetsu a vanguard player anymore which was really really insane so it's going to be interesting will he even be reversed will he even be um so-called possessed at all or will he, just, uh, will he just actually stick by Ren's side instead and just watch along the go being a spectator? But overall, definitely really interesting to see how things will actually turn out. Um, but we can actually see quite a bit of uh, Corin fighting back. And we can see a lot more of the connection and the relationship uh, Corin actually has with Misaki as well. So... That's going to be very cool. It might be uh, something that's leading up to the uh, Legion arc. So uh, we'll just have to find out. But for now, I am very excited about this one. Uh, but this episode, there was actually not too much happening. It was more so just, uh, you know, members of Ultra Ray actually defeating players to get them to join the Psyqualia zombie invasion. So it's definitely going to be really crazy to see how this plays out. Last time, Kai was actually the... Uh, main villain of the Link Joker arc, kind of. He was kind of the main guy possessing everyone, but uh, it's definitely going to be um, an interesting thing to see how Kai will actually play out his role here, because uh, he also actu actually has to uh, fight Ibuki as well, so, you know, perhaps Kai will actually stay on the good side and he won't be possessed, because now we actually have um, Ibuki now. Because in the original series, uh, Ibuki wasn't actually in there. He he came later on in the movie, and as a result, Kai kind of had to take on the uh, villain role here. Uh, I just really can't predict anything at this point anymore because we have just so many different things happening, and uh, there's just so much to expect. But tell me what you guys actually thought about this particular episode and what might come about. Um, this is just insanely crazy. Uh, but yeah, in the meantime, hope you guys have a great day and hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you next time.